All right, here we have a, uh, the Lee Avenue pedestrian road crossing in Orlando, Florida. This is on the Florida Central Railroad. Got two gated signals here. First one here has a progress rail signal base. Western Colin Hayes gate mechanism and a side mounted Western Colin Hayes mechanical bell. That's what it sounds like. Here's a view of the back. Here's the emergency information. Cross buck right there in a single, um, I have no idea who made that gate light, but it's probably Western Colin Hayes or Progress Rail. So yeah, these are my first time seeing these mast mounted Western Colin Hayes mechanical bells before. Pretty interesting. They're used in the south quite a bit on the short lines. Over here we got Progress Rail signal base, Western Colony's gate mechanism. Yeah, sorry I haven't zoomed in because um, if I don't, it gets really dark. So I want you to actually be able to see stuff. Western Colony's gate mechanism, Western Colony's mechanical bell, side mounted. Here's the emergency info. That's interesting. Each bell has a different sound. Let's see if I can get a view of what this would look like from down here. Not really. I guess I just have to do it like that. See how much darker it gets when I go in the wide lens? That's weird and annoying. I hate that it does that. It makes it hard to do some pictures and shots. Anyway, um, the relay case is down there. And it's actually shared with that next crossing, and that's the Beach Street pedestrian crossing. And it literally is identical to this. There's nothing different about it. These are pretty new signals. Um, I know one of them replaced a set of gateless 8-inch light signals. I can't remember what the other one did. They may have both been that way. So kind of funny, the last one had was gateless but had lights. This one is gated but doesn't have lights. But yeah, quite a cool crossing setup right here. Uh, so this is the Lee Avenue pedestrian crossing in Orlando, Florida. Thanks for watching over and out.